Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. All users mistype or misspell words. There may be words that you seem to mistype frequently. Word provides another text tool called Autocorrect that stores common misspellings of words. It then automatically replaces them as they occur in a document. For example, if you commonly mistype the word the as T-E-H, when you type it and then hit spacebar to move away as if you were going to continue typing, Word will automatically fix that misspelling for you as you're typing. Now another convenient feature of autocorrect is the ability to create an autocorrect entry for a longer word or phrase that you often type. For example, let's say the name of your company that you work for is Hyper Mega Global Comp Corporation. That would really be irritating to type over and over and every single document that you have. So what you could do instead is you could create an autocorrect entry for it that's a bit shorter, like HMGC. Then whenever you wanted to type your company's name, you could simply type HMGC and tap the spacebar key on your keyboard to replace that entry with a full company name instead of having to type it out every time. So to view the autocorrect feature, select Tools from the menu bar and choose Autocorrect Options. Or if you're using the 2097 version, it would simply be Tools and Autocorrect. This brings up the Autocorrect dialog box. Here, make sure that you are viewing the Autocorrect tab. And here is where we can actually turn on or off Autocorrect options for Word. So, Autocorrect does many things. It can correct the usage of two initial capitals at the beginning of a sentence. It'll capitalize the first letter of sentences if you don't. It'll capitalize the first letter of table cells if you forget. It also capitalizes the names of days and corrects the accidental usage of the caps lock key on your keyboard. The section that we're looking at is the replacing text as you type. And down below you can see a listing of different characters that if you type that, which is shown on the left, it will replace it with the item shown on the right. You can add your own. So for example, if we clicked and dragged over this and went to Tools and Autocorrect Options, here in the Replace box we can type in our little code and we will replace the HMGC with either the plain text version or the formatted version of the text shown. And then what you would do is you would click Add to add that to the list. Notice that your replacement words should always be nonsense words or words that aren't real words. I wouldn't want to replace something like the word work with Hyper Mega Global Comp Corporation because then I could never actually type the word work into a sentence because it would automatically replace it. So your replacements have to be some sort of little code. Once that's set, just click OK at the bottom of the dialog box. And notice in the future when we type in HMGC and then space away, it replaces it automatically for us. Now to delete an autocorrect entry that you no longer use, you must go to Tools and then down to the Autocorrect Options command or simply Autocorrect once again if you're using 97 or 2000. In the Replace box, start typing in the little code that represents the phrase that you no longer are going to be using. Click once on it to bring it up in the list below. Then press the Delete button right below that and then when you're finished, click OK at the bottom of the dialog box again. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.